So the stars are back in the ballroom last night. The 30th season of Dancing with the Stars kicked off. All eyes were on Olivia Jade, who performed a salsa with her partner Val. She got good scores from the judges, but some people on social media blasted Olivia after she said she is best known as a social media influencer and made no mention of the college admissions scandal. Beverly Hills 90210 star Brian Austin Green got paired with his real life girlfriend, pro dancer Sharna Burgess, but people are saying that's an unfair advantage. Martin Love, or Cove rather, from Cobra Kai, underwhelmed the judges and barely even moved on the dance floor. I love it. Okay, <laughs> and Jojo Siwa made history by dancing with a same-sex partner. The pair recovered after Jojo's partner stumbled during the routine. Still, Jojo received the highest score of the night. Okay, let's go back to Olivia Jade because that's what all of our viewers are talking about as I speak. They feel like that she should have taken that first opportunity out to talk about her involvement with the college admission scandal and not brand herself as a influencer when most people don't know her as that. Right, I mean, th this is up to your PR. They sit down before you go out for something as big as a show like this, and you discuss your strategy. You say, are we gonna steer into it? Or are we gonna kind of put it to the wayside? And both have worked for different celebrities in different situations. She's choosing not to address it and move forward. And at 19 years old, I don't know if I wouldn't tell a 19 year old that I loved Erica, you made a big mistake, it, coerced by some adults. Let's try and move forward and have you grow as a person rather than continue to regress. I get that people wanted her to address it, but it's also well within her right not to. Yeah, I mean, when, at what point do you move on from this, Erica? You're talking about comebacks. When do you move on? Her parents went to prison for this. They went to jail for this, right? She's paid her dues to society. They paid their dues to society. It's time to move on. If she's 30 years old, does she have to answer, oh, yeah, you might know me from the college admission scandal as well? It's in the past. It's over. Uh, yeah, I can, I can understand this from both perspectives. I do think that everyone is deserving of the comeback they're willing to earn. Um, and, you know, in all fairness, to be honest, she was a child when all of this went down. So I think if this was a different situation and it didn't reek of just grotesque privilege, we'd probably be thinking of this a little differently. But here we are. This is a litmus test for the soul of America. How do people feel about Olivia Jade? But also, it's a, it's a, a strategy. If she gave everything up, you can't give everything up the first episode. So you got to wait. <laughs> so people, if people want to know yeah. straight from her mouth, then they're going to have to keep her on the show. And that's just the way that this show works. It's a redemption story for everybody. Yeah, I do think at some point we're going to hear her story. And Tyra Banks, when we had Tyra on the show, she did allude to that. Do you remember that? But I will say Olivia Jade would not be on Dancing with the Stars without the college admission scandal. Right. And that's frustrating. I get that they're, that this show or that show rather is going to pull very controversial uh, people like they had with with Anthony or Spicer. What's his Sean first Spicer. name? Sean Spicer. I was going to say, would he have been on the show? No, no, he would not. But right. again, so that's kind of what this show is. So you can't have the show and not have the controversy to follow some of the. I get the pushback. I get why people are like, look, she's profiting from it, even though it's her parents should should take the brunt of most of the blame. But right. I, America I, loves a redemption story, Sam. Yeah, we will hear from her. I guarantee you. Mark my word. If okay. you keep her on. If they keep her on. Mm-hmm.